Hi guys, today in this video we are going to find out if SeF4 is a polar or non-polar molecule. So to find out the polarity of any molecule or ion, we have to first look at its Lewis structure, its shape and to check if there is a net dipole moment in the molecule. So in SeF4, uh, selenium is the central atom that is forming bonds with four fluorine atoms. Uh, if you look at its Lewis structure, selenium atom has a lone pair of electrons. So generally the molecules in which central atoms have lone pairs are asymmetrical and due to which there is a polarity in this molecule. But to confirm it further we are going to look at its shape. So here is its shape and you can see here due to the repulsion of lone pair on the central atom these, uh, these bonds are pushed towards each other and hence the structure is not symmetric. Now, if you look at the electronegativity values of selenium and fluorine, fluorine is more electronegative than selenium atom. So, the electrons that are shared between selenium and fluorine atoms will be pulled towards fluorine atom more because it is more electronegative. So, basically fluorine will have more, will try to pull the shared electrons towards itself. Hence, there will be a dipole moment which will be towards the fluorine atoms. Now, this will be common for all the fluorine atoms in this uh, molecule as there are four fluorine atoms. And as there is no symmetry in this molecule and due to this lone pair, there are uneven distribution of charges, there will be a net dipole moment in this molecule. And as there is a net dipole moment in this molecule, there will be poles formed in this molecules in which regions around selenium atom will have partial positive charges and regions around fluorine atoms will have partial negative charges. And as this molecule has poles, it is a polar molecule. So SeFO4 or selenium tetrafluoride is a polar molecule. I hope this video helps you to understand the polarity of SeF4. For more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.